All right, folks, welcome back to the channel. We're thrilled to have you here with us today. Today, we're diving deep into the world of nutrition and busting some myths about getting those six-pack abs. It's not just about hitting the gym hard, it's about making smart choices with what you eat. Let's be real, we all want that shredded physique, but sometimes, it feels like we're putting in the work and not seeing the results. It can be incredibly frustrating, right? Well, I'm here to tell you, it's not always about how many crunches you can crank out, but what you're putting into your body. Your diet plays a crucial role in achieving those ab goals. That's right, we're talking about food. The right nutrition can make or break your fitness journey. There are some sneaky food devils out there, disguised as harmless snacks or even healthy options that could be sabotaging your ab goals. It's time to uncover these hidden culprits and make better choices. First up, we're tackling the sugary drink dilemma. We're talking soda, sports drinks, those fancy coffee concoctions. You know the ones. They're loaded with sugar, and I'm not talking about the good kind. This stuff goes straight to your liver, and guess what it turns into? That's right, fat. And where does your body love to store fat? You got it, right around your midsection. So, if you're serious about those abs, ditch the sugary drinks and stick to water, my friends. Next up, we're going after processed foods. These things are like the zombies of the food world. They just won't die. They're everywhere, and they're packed with preservatives, unhealthy fats, and enough sodium to make a salt mine jealous. All that junk messes with your gut health, slows down your metabolism, and before you know it, you've got a spare tire you can't seem to shake. So, do yourself a favor and stick to whole, unprocessed foods as much as possible. Now, let's talk about everyone's favorite social lubricant, alcohol. It's the life of the party, the icebreaker at social gatherings, and often the go-to for unwinding after a long day. Look, I enjoy a cold beer or a glass of whiskey as much as the next guy, but let's be real, alcohol is not your friend when it comes to getting ripped. It might seem harmless, but those drinks add up. It's basically empty calories, and it messes with your body's ability to burn fat. Your metabolism takes a hit, and your progress in the gym can be significantly slowed down. Plus, it lowers your inhibitions, which means you're more likely to reach for that greasy pizza at 2 a.m. Those late-night cravings can derail your diet and set you back. So, if you're serious about those abs, you gotta moderate your alcohol intake. It's not about cutting it out completely, but finding a balance that works for your fitness goals. Remember, every choice counts. Chapter 4. Refined Grains. The Wolf in Sheep's Clothing. Alright, let's talk about refined grains. These sneaky devils hide in plain sight, disguised as harmless bread, pasta, and rice. But don't be fooled, my friends. These refined grains are stripped of their nutrients, and they spike your blood sugar like a rocket. And what happens when your blood sugar goes haywire? You guessed it. Your body starts storing fat, especially around your midsection. So, ditch the white bread and opt for whole grains instead. Chapter 5. Fried Foods. The Crispy Critters. Killing Your Gains. Let's be honest, we all love a good plate of fries or a crispy chicken wing. But let's call a spade a spade. Fried foods are loaded with calories and unhealthy fats that will wreck your six-pack dreams faster than you can say extra crispy. They're like sponges for oil, soaking up all those unhealthy fats that your body just doesn't need. So, if you're serious about getting shredded, you gotta limit your intake of fried foods. Chapter 6. High Calorie Snacks The Snack Attack on Your Abs now, let's talk about those tempting treats that sabotage our best intentions. High-calorie snacks. We're talking chips, cookies, candy bars. All those delicious little devils that are engineered to be addictive. They're loaded with sugar, unhealthy fats, and empty calories that go straight to your waistline. 
So, next time you're reaching for a snack, opt for something healthy and satisfying, like fruits, vegetables, or nuts. Chapter 7. Dairy Products The Utter Truth About Bloating Listen, I'm not saying dairy is the devil, it's got its place, but for some people, it can cause bloating and inflammation, which can make your stomach look, well, less than flat. We're talking about lactose intolerance, my friends. If you're sensitive to dairy, it can wreak havoc on your gut, leading to bloating, gas, and discomfort. So, if you're noticing that dairy doesn't sit well with you, it might be worth exploring dairy-free alternatives. All right, meat lovers, this one's for you. I love a good steak as much as the next carnivore, but let's be real. Red meat can be a tricky beast when it comes to getting shredded. It's often high in saturated fat, which can contribute to weight gain, especially around the midsection. Now, I'm not saying you have to give up red meat entirely, but moderation is key. Opt for leaner cuts of meat and consider incorporating more plant-based protein sources into your diet. Let's talk about artificial sweeteners, those seemingly innocent sugar substitutes that promise guilt-free sweetness. But here's the thing, they might be tricking your taste buds, but they're not fooling your body. Studies have shown that artificial sweeteners can actually mess with your metabolism and lead to increased fat storage, especially around your belly. So ditch the diet soda and artificial sweeteners and stick to natural sweeteners in moderation. Now, this one might surprise you. Fruit juice. I know, I know, it seems healthy, right? It's got fruit in the name. But here's the thing. Fruit juice is often loaded with sugar, even the 100% natural stuff. When you juice fruits, you're stripping away the fiber, which helps regulate blood sugar levels. Without the fiber, the sugar in fruit juice can spike your blood sugar, leading to fat storage especially around your midsection. So there you have it, folks. The top 10 foods that could be sabotaging your six-pack dreams. Remember, getting those chiseled abs is not just about hitting the gym hard, it's also about fueling your body with the right kind of fuel. Eating a balanced diet rich in nutrients is key. By making smarter food choices, like opting for fresh fruits and vegetables, and ditching these ab saboteurs, such as sugary snacks and processed foods, you'll be well on your way to uncovering those shredded abs you've been working so hard for. Consistency is key, so stay dedicated. If you found this video helpful, hit that like button and share it with your friends. And subscribe to the channel for more awesome content. We have plenty of tips and tricks to help you on your fitness journey. And as always, thanks for watching.